what you guys are going to get um a large mushroom and onion yeah that's it okay so we're restraining this cat and we're in med b and it's like <laughs> <laughs> you know exactly oh, what I'm going to say. Oh, oh, my God. Oh, my God. I was God. in there. I had my own patient on, on a table. <laughs> so like, this cat starts <laughs> peeing everywhere, and it's, it's trying to weird. escape, and so its butt is wiggling around. I think around. Victoria had it by its legs, and it was just, and it like, was just... aiming like a super soaker. <laughs> it was everywhere, and we also needed urine on this cat, so we're like, catch it, catch it. Jasmine <laughs> oh was running around catching the pee in this cup, and like, Meanwhile, Max is like dodging. It was like me and Nav in there. We both like just like split. Yeah, you just dodge it. And like in the aftermath, we looked and the walls and the chair and the opposite table and the entire floor and almost everyone in the room was like covered in intact male cat pee. <laughs> My name is Max Emanuel and I'm from Weston, Connecticut. She was hit by a car. She's a rescue. She's not my patient or anything, but I do treatments here, and she's just like a really sweet girl, and uh, I like giving her some love. <laughs> Originally, I didn't get into Penn. I was put on the wait list. All right, Rose. Good girl. But I remember waking up from a nap and getting called, asking me if I wanted another chance at, at going to Penn. It was, I didn't even think twice. It, it was like one of the great moments of my life. I'd always known that animals are something that I, I loved and was passionate about, but it wasn't until I actually did it while life conservation course in Kenya. That really got my excitement going.